Hello and thank you for choosing to watch this video. Today I would like to demonstrate how we can take a Diamond SG2000 58 Wave mobile with antenna and prepare it for convenient backpack portable use. First of all we must remove one grub screw from each section of the antenna and then replace this with the Duraplast thumb turn screw. This then allows us to quickly break down and reassemble the antenna out in the field. Now that we've removed the grub screw, we can apply our Duraplast screw. Then apply the second element of the antenna. That can be securely fixed into place. Once the antenna has been disassembled, it can be stored in a homemade portable storage tube. All parts can be purchased off the shelf at your local DIY store. The antenna can be stored in a tube which is no more than 700mm in length. The storage tube is made from 40mm PVC waste pipe. A stop end is applied to the base and a screw cap is applied to the top. Two straps have been applied and riveted on and they can be used to fix it to a rucksack um, for easy carrying. A stop end is applied at the base. Two hook and eye fabric straps have been fixed to the tube, however a carry handle may be preferred. A screw cap is applied at the top. When out in the field, this antenna can be mounted to a stainless steel quick clamp claw. No grounding is required for this antenna, therefore the quick clamp claw can be fixed to a timber picnic bench if required. Additionally, you may wish to mount the antenna on a mount such as this one. This can now be mounted on a pole such as this one which is made from 500mm sections of tent pole. An engineering washer has been drilled and paracord guide lines have been fixed to the washer. You will notice that the guide lines do not have proprietary tensioners as it is easier to use a taut line knot. A taut line knot can be very easily made. like so. This will give you the opportunity to tension your line like so. The knot can just be easily slid up and down to suit the length of the cord. I hope that this video has been informative and that you can adapt or adopt some of my ideas for your own field station operations. Thank you for watching.